there is something that most South Africans, most young South Africans have access to and something that is very much part of their identity and that is a cell phone. And so Funza thought that in order, if our aim is to get young people reading for pleasure, we can use the cell phone. We, we always had that at the back of our minds, that in modern times it would be crazy not to use something that is so ubiquitous. Funza has a Moby network and we, it, that means that our stories are available via, through the internet and via cell phones. I found them on Mixit in 2011 and then I started reading the stories. They became my thing to do because I was working at the time at a call centre. So I would go on to read the stories every day on my way to work and back. Mixit was our solution to reach a huge number of people. And um, so we published the stories on a weekly basis. So each um, short story, they're seven chapters long, they start, they're loaded on Fridays at midnight as we go into Friday and some of the Funza fans will stay up till midnight waiting for that story to come on. A new story is put up on a Friday with a chapter released every single day which really hooks the readers and, and keeps them coming back for more. The stories are then archived in our library and so there's a full library on a phone with a huge variety of stories and genres and authors. And we really use those networks as well to not only spread our books but also um, the, to promote our movie network as well because it's obviously a space that people can really read for free. We have a home page which kind of shows the hit of the week which is our latest story and then we've got a section which shows on the home page the most popular stories. I think our greatest achievement really is, is getting the kind of numbers of, of readers reading. Every day we have between six and 12,000 people, individuals, coming to our Moby network and reading something. And over the course of a month that translates into more than 50,000 people that have connected with us. It's incredible because it doesn't make a difference if 10,000 people read a story on a cell phone or if 100,000 people read it, it still costs the same. So it's a hugely efficient way of getting to people where, who don't have access to books.